Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the audio normalizer in Femora 10. So this is a new feature of Femora 10 and I think it's, it is very interesting. So here I am inside Femora 10. So you can see on the, uh, on the timeline, I have a clip of me talking about a special effect. And I also adjust the audio level here. For example, at this part, uh, I want to make it very, very high. And at this part, uh, I adjust it to very low. So very low, uh, high, low, and high, and normal. So we have different parts um, in my video. With the audio normalizer, we can balance the audio of all this part uh, just uh, in one click. Okay, so in uh, to avoid laggy issue, I'm going to detach the audio of all the clip and to keep only one audio track on the timeline only. Okay, so I'm going to select all of them on the timeline and right click and select detach audio. So that by doing that, I will have only one audio track and I'm going to delete the, the video here because I don't, I don't think I, I need to see myself talking on in front of the camera. So we can delete it. And now we have this in the first part and this is the second part, the lower part, and this is a high volume also. This is normal part. And now we can play the video, uh, play the audio. By the way, I want to see the audio, uh, audio meter. So I'm going to click here to pull out the audio meter here. So let's play it. One, two, three, two, three, two, three. So it is, it is a lot, a little bit uh, choppy. So let's play it again. One, two, three. Hello, everyone. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going. So you see, so you see that this is a high level and this is low level. In order to use the audio normalizer, all we need to do to select uh, select the clip that we want to apply this audio effect, and then right click, select adjust audio. Okay, so here's the new feature. We can click here, and the software will adjust the the, the audio to normalize it. Perfect. Okay, so you can see the audio waveform, it changed, right? And now we can listen and the balance of the volume. Here, let's listen from the beginning. One, two, three. Hello, everyone. Welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to show you how... I think it's okay. Okay, so that is how you can use the audio normalizer. It is very easy, right? Uh, but in some cases, uh, when you use the audio normalizer and you want to... Uh, to adjust the volume of the, the this track, for example, because you don't want to do it manually, you use the audio normalizer. So uh, you can use this one, the audio mixer. And it is um, my best friend when it comes to editing audio in inside Femora 10. Because uh, here I can control the volume of different video track and audio track on the timelines at once. So supposing that you have multiple video or audio in one track and you want to increase the volume of that track uh, so you can do it here at the audio mixer for example here uh, we have the timeline here and then we can play and one two then we can see this is the audio level for this uh this track so this is the audio number one and this is a master audio control okay so for example here we can reduce the volume uh, of this audio track and also increase this master volume if if I want, okay. Uh, on the right side, you have also um, the option to change to stereo or surround here, and that is the audio mixer. Okay, so that is everything about the audio normalizer and how you can uh, adjust the volume of one video track uh, or the timeline. If you have any further question about editing audio inside Femora 10, uh, let me know in the comment section below. If you like the tutorial, don't forget to like it and hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you are new here. Okay, thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.